Hi solo birds, it's another beautiful day in Colombia. Um, today I'm doing something special. I am leaving my neighborhood Lorelis where I am living now and I am heading to the neighborhood Santa Domingo. I'm super excited because you know, your girl's been working a lot so I haven't really been able to explore the city. Um, and so I'm excited to see a different neighborhood outside of where I've been. And yeah, I'm gonna take you guys with me, enjoy. tickets and then take the train this is my first time on the train so i'm pretty excited about it i'm you know getting used to where i am and so yeah i'm curious to know how much the ticket's gonna be um and just the cost of living and everything trip card we're taking the train to on um, the San, Anto San Antonio train it's the way to Santo Domingo I'm walking up these steep stairs I'm getting flashbacks in New York and yeah we're gonna wait for the train and yeah the train that we took only goes like three stops so we realized we got to one stop and then the train started going back the other way so we actually were supposed to get off and possibly transfer to another train so here we are we're gonna walk to the other side of the train station to get back on the train that we were before to go back the other way and then get off the stop but this is what comes with exploring and traveling and learning your city so it's okay train number two train number two Wait, why ain't nobody taking it Yes. I think people just want to get their exercise. Oh. Hi right, guys. Down the escalator we go. Not sure where we are, but whatever. I'm down for the adventure. Do you think that we're? Oh, we have to transfer. How do you know what is what? Okay, guys, so I think we have to transfer trains take another train so we just got to this train station and transferring to another train i think a room for the view and you I'll show you guys the little, the, the, some of the concerts we saw when I was on the train. Um, that's where we are. You know what I mean? About what I saw. Yeah, I think we have to, we were supposed to go. 
Yep. Another detour. <laughs> so we actually left the train station. You have to be in the train station oh, to catch the cable cars, right? So what happens now is uh, when we got and realized we did it, we came back in and then found out that cable cars are actually under maintenance, so we can't take them up the hill. So what we're gonna do now is we came back in, asked for information, and they told us, okay, there's another cable car that's actually working today and not in maintenance, you guys can take that. So they let us back in the train station, even though we had already walked out because we didn't know. Um, and we're gonna take the other one on the other side. So as, as I said before, that's traveling. So I'll tell you what we did today. We took the train to Central, transferred to another train. That took us to Asibido, which is this stop that we're here, to take the cable cars up the hill in Medellin. So I'm super excited. I'm gonna show you guys. They're going. You guys see the cable cars are going up? to the cable cars officially we made it um we're about to board you don't have to pay again once you get inside the train station you don't have to pay so we're getting ready to board and i'm gonna get to see medellin i'm so nervous because we're gonna be so high up and it's gonna swing kind of like when you're on the ferris wheel but i definitely think it's gonna be worth it traveling is about facing your fears so let's do it We're officially, we're on, we're on the cable car, and I'm so nervous, but excited at the same time. Is the door going to close? Yeah. It should close. Are we supposed to press a button or something? Oh, okay. Sorry guys, we know if the door's going to close. Here we go. This is like a grill ride, like, it's a little strange, but uh, there's Medellin, there's the mountains. Here we go. It's a little like, laggy. It's got my life in his hands. <laughs> wow, guys. Look at this. There you go, look. I don't want to look back, I'm too scared. It's the best view. Oh my gosh. So the gondola lift system implemented by the City Council of Medellin, Colombia, it was designed to reach some of the city's most informal settlements on the steep hills that mark its topography. Medellin is located in the Burra Valley and is surrounded by hills, and many of those hills are home to undeveloped barrios, which is due to their location, cannot be reached by Medellin's biggest mass transportation system. Many of these barrios are in fact located in steep grounds to the extent that not even a regular bus system could be either useful or commercially profitable. Before the implementation of Metro Cable Line K, residents of Santa Domingo Savio Barrio spent up to two and a half hours commuting to work each going? way. Because we're about to find to through a station and now we're going even further up. Your girl is freaking out, but also at the same time, like it's thrilling and it's exciting. Right? It's just kind of like whatever about it, but we're going pretty high, y'all. We're going pretty high. Oh, shut up. We're going up the mountains. Oh my god. This guy's whipping out a shot. <laughs> Taking a shot here in Medellin. Um, going into the hills. Yeah. Beautiful day though. Beautiful. The longer I rode the gondola lift, it became to be a little less scary and I really begin to ponder and think about traveling every day two and a half hours just to get to work and the same way back. I'm sure the people that live here in the barrios and the steep hills are very thankful for this system and I begin to be thankful for it as well. but I think I did what I'm supposed to do <laughs> in regards to this experience. We're so high up in the mountains. It's beautiful, you guys. Medellin, about it is, I lived in New York. I've been in different cities. And um, I can say Medellin is so well maintained. You guys, it's going even higher. Look at this. We got off. It's going even higher, guys, but I'm not gonna lie to you. I cannot do it. I could not go any higher. I mean, I could have. We could have duped it out, but like, we got a lot of things that we need to do today. So, um, yeah. So, now we're going to take it back the other down. So, we're going to go down. And, yeah. 
it's so interesting because the locals are just like whatever on the cable car and I'm like all stressed and nervous. that we took the experience we didn't go all the way up as i said before but maybe next time we'll try next time we'll try to bring a little picnic and a glass of wine or something so we just got off the train and we're back on our local loser lane which we have here which is 70 carrera here and uh medellin we're gonna head back home do some work and um eat Colombian place it's around the corner of my apartment that I've been wanting to go but I never have pesos your girl never goes to get pesos I always use my card so I finally had some today and I'm gonna try it I'll show you guys it um, my meal is starting out with the soup which looks really delicious tomato I mean potatoes chicken maybe some chicharrones look at that soup guys so delicious there is chicken a fan but I don't know this is my Alright guys, the grand finale. I wanted a pescado frita, which is fried fish. Um, this is tilapia, came with avocado, rice, looks like a smashed fly plantain, avocado, salad, and of course it came with the delicious spice on it as well. Looks great. Alright guys, I got fried tilapia, all for $5.65. That's, that's a deal. You most likely anywhere are gonna pay at least 20 to 30 dollars for this. I'm in disbelief. I'm literally in disbelief. I pray that after this is time. Y'all know talking about going to ceremony in low time. Mm -hmm. My bitch is torture. I ain't doing no ceremony in low time. In regards to like the safety nets or? Yeah, I'm Asian, man. I am here in 70 Caera, which is the main street on my road, and I am getting tacos. The girl is cheating today and she's eating pastor. I wanted the pastor and the pineapple. So here I am. We got, well, I got tres tacos for. I don't know, it was 5,000 pesos, which if I'm not mistaken is around $2. Um, and yeah, I'll show you guys later. Not my breast. Pretty good. Oh, it's spicy. I put a little bit of sauce. It's getting me good. But it's good. It's good. 